Okay, in this question we have a mapping notation. xy goes to x minus 2 and negative y plus 5. It's used to describe a transformation of a function f of x into a function g of x. So we have 10 different possible transformations listed there. We want to know in correct order the transformations to transform f of x into g of x. And there are three possible options, more than one correct answer. So I'm not going to go through every possible way of doing this question. Let's go with the most basic way of doing it. Mapping notation is literally what happens point to point. So I'm going to follow the mapping notation as they have shown. First one is I have x minus 2. So that literally means I'm taking every x value and decreasing it by 2. Another way of saying that is I am translating two units to the left. And that is a horizontal translation. So my first option here, I am horizontally translating that two units to the left. That would be option number six. Okay, next one, I have negative y plus 5. So let's break that apart, first of all, in the negative y part. So negative y means that I'm multiplying all my y values by negative 1. So think about that. If y is positive and I multiply it by negative 1, it becomes negative. If y is negative and I multiply it by negative 1, it becomes positive. So what that is, is a vertical reflection. And when we reflect things vertically, we reflect them in the x-axis. So vertical reflection in the x-axis, that would be option number one. And then plus five, when I add five to a y value, that is again a translation. This time it is a vertical translation and it's literally five units up. So my option would be translation five units up. In terms of the correct order when we do things, if I'm following the mapping notation, I would follow my order where reflection and stretch come first, translation comes last. So I'm going to write this in the order of reflection and translation last. So for the most basic way of doing it, I would say 167, or you could also say 176. There are other ways of doing the question. This is just following the direct mapping notation.